Hi, my name is Alyssa Lucas. Uh, first, I want to apologize for the video quality, but this is just kind of how it looks for me on Zoom. Um, so beginning with which movie did I prefer out of the two? I love them both. And I feel so hard. To, it feels so hard to pick one because they're both very different from one another. But I would have to say that my favorite is Interstellar. Not that I don't love a Pixar movie. Inside Out is a really good one. But um, Interstellar, I'd never seen it before. I'd seen Pixar a couple, um, the Pixar, like Inside Out a couple of times. And so it's, it's always fun to see it again. But um, they're just there that like the score and the cinematography and just like how you always felt like on the edge of your seat. Honestly, that movie looks like a blast to see in theaters. But um, I would say just um, Interstellar was my favorite. And one of my favorite scenes is where his um like his daughter realizes he's her ghost and that like there's that whole scene of like all these different future like all the like the future in the bookshelf and I'm going to show it but it's just it's really it's really captivating and um I'm gonna share it. <laughs> it's a very long I would say it's a very long scene but um but when it's all moving it's just it's really cool um I would also say my favorite character from the movie was was Murphy you know Murphy's Law Murph um because she, she was really relatable in terms of like they were all very relatable characters in regards to their motives and why they did what they did it's not like because even the bad characters are the bad you could say that they're evil, which they do some pretty evil things, but it's very human things that could be expected. Um, but in regards to Murphy, um, her just, even after she feels like her dad betrays her and leaves her, she still like works towards the future that he wanted and for the future for other people on earth. And, um, and it was really brilliant for her to like have she even had to have faith in the like her, her realizing her ghost was real um I would say I don't I question her decision of burning down the cornfield I feel like it wasn't her decision to make for the family to leave like it's not like they had much luxury in that but besides that she's a I understand why she did it I just didn't agree with it very complex character in that regard um and then, 
yeah so for the other like there's no reason I didn't like the other film Inside Out is a great movie and I also think it's just not only can adults relate to it because we've like been there done that but I think it's just a really good way for kids to see their emotions but also it's just got some like the scenes in there are really cute and just it seems like there's just so much symbolism and the islands and it's I have no complaints against the movie I just wouldn't say that it like ex- very stands out to me and the world of film it's a good movie but like if there was like a pixar movie i was to choose there's a couple that would rank more that i would be like this is a full standout movie and i think because interstellar just has like that score and everything attached to it is what really just sets it apart um and then so one thing about the 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 style of the film and the first chapter readings for interstellar i was thinking a lot about the camera work um more specifically like um let me find it i'm so sorry so the first one i really noticed was the establishing shot in interstellar and it shows the bookshelf and and the watch and like when you first watch the movie you're like that's the little girl's shelf that's so cool like i didn't realize I'm sure there was everything signifying it. Even I thought like she's maybe she's delusional, but realizing like how much importance that has later on, I think it just really like is a, it's a very interesting detail for everything tying back to that. Um, And as stated earlier, the sound in this movie was amazing. There are so many different digest. I cannot say the word so please understand what I'm saying digentic uh, sounds like the rocket blasting and then there's like those like sudden like just loud blasts of noise and then quiet which really um gives perception to like how the people hear it and I think that would be I'm not sure if this is exactly what the book was saying but that I think that would be subjective like that's how the people experience it um but in regards to like the shots and the sound that goes along to with it, I think that's what really can make a movie. Um, and I was just really impressed by it. But overall, these were two really great watches. And I'm excited for the week ahead and what more to watch. And noticing more about like how directors like make the movies and making them look so artistic. Yeah. Cool. Bye.